I'm Johnny Scoville and this is Chase the Heat. People, uh, recently I uh, had the opportunity to do a review for Starkiss Tuna. They're bold creations. First I did their jalapeno. Liked it. Then I did their spicy uh, or spicy Thai chili, which I really liked. Uh, it tasted so good. Um, got something cool to show you right now. You guys know that Starkiss isn't the only tuna game in town. Check this out. This is from Bumblebee. They did it too. This is their version of wild caught spicy Thai chili tuna. It's going to be fun to see how they, if they taste the same, if there's a difference. Sure, there's lots of fish in the sea, but there's only one Bumblebee. Wild caught, incredibly delicious. This is tuna bursting with lean protein and crave-worthy flavor combinations. Dive in. Love at first bite. We will see. Sounds good, though. Again, light tuna. Aren't coming across any of that fat tuna. On the kind of the running for your life thing. Uh, all right, light tuna, water, onion, sugar, uh, onion, sugar. Seasoning, which is sugar, maltodextrin, salt, onion powder, chili powder, 2% of uh, or less of the following. Garlic powder, silicon dioxide as an anti-caking agent. Man, I get it, but that is just something that sounds like you ought not to be ingesting. You know, it just sounds like after three minutes in, the silicon dioxide took its course and after he gave his last words, he was pronounced dead at 10.15. That's what it sounds like. I'm sorry. I know it was dark, but that's kind of what it sounds like to me. All right. Uh, caramel color. Extra tips of paprika for color. Citric acid. Spice and spice extra tips. Natural. It doesn't say which ones. Just let you know they're in there. Uh, natural flavors. Red bell pepper. Nice. 2% less of uh, modified cornstarch. Ginger, maltodextrin, natural flavors, yeast extract, garlic, uh, juice con garlic, and it says juice concentrate. Doesn't tell you what kind, just says juice concentrate. Onion juice, oh, I'm sorry, garlic juice concentrate and onion juice concentrate. And then crushed red pepper and salt. Uh, contains tuna, they want you to know that. And some coconut. Funny, it didn't say coconut anywhere in the listing. Maybe that's one of the other flavors that they don't actually tell you about. Uh, people wild caught, lean protein, gluten free. Uh, thank you. They listen, it's a product of Thailand. All right, we're going to see how they compare to, uh, you know. Oh, look what they do here. Check out what they do differently than Starkist. In the bag, you can feel something. I was like, what is that? In the bag, they give you. A little snap together. But you know what this is going to do? It's going to taint my tuna. And I'll not have that. There'll be no taintage. But how cool is that that they include a spoon in case you didn't have your spoon with you? Necessary. All right. Oh. It smells really good. Okay, it doesn't smell. I can't notice it. It's not like, ah, oh, total different. And if I had it two side by side, it'd be better, but I don't. But it smells, it reminds me of the same thing the other one smelled like. Visually, there's way more red pepper, uh, red bell pepper, in the other one. Remember every spoonful I pulled out, there was chunks of red pepper. Maybe it's hiding in here, but I'm not seeing it. And that's okay. There is some on the spoon right there, people. There you go. There you go. All right, so we'll do this for the... This is where our thumbnail came from, people. The birth of a thumbnail. There it was. All right. Smells good. All right, so from Bumblebee, this is their spicy, wild-caught Thai chili. I'm Johnny Scoble, and this is Chase the Heat. Nope. 
the other one's way better. Not even a little better. Maybe that one was sweet Thai chili, and this is just spicy Thai chili. I'm not worried about the spice. Spice isn't the issue. The flavor of the other is way better. Now, if, the, if I had never had the other, and this is the only thing I ever had, I'd be like, wow, that bumblebee is incredible. It's true. It's not bad at all. It's just not as, it's not as good. Now, I'll bet you money. Anybody who's had the two that goes to the comment section is going to echo what I just said. I thought it was going to be hard. I thought it not being side by side, it would be difficult to discern the difference. I'm telling you, that is way better. I'm not eating the rest of it. I'll give it to my son. He'll love it. Uh, I want to talk about a couple of things. Uh, communication. It's my cell phone. I don't uh, talk on it much. Do you know this? Probably, I'm trying to think. Other than my my immediate family, Tommy, my brother, my uh, mom, my sisters. Other than my immediate family, and I'm being honest with you, there's one or two, one or two people I talk to ever on the phone. Now. That said, I'm going to be in Australia soon. I'm going to keep my phone number, but I'm not going to be using my phone. Listen, if you guys, if, if people that need to reach out to me, you reach out to me through, most people reach out to me, they don't know my phone number. So most people want to get a hold of me. They find me on Instagram. They'll find me on Facebook. They'll send me a message, one or the other, or they'll send me an email. On Instagram, we can always communicate there. We can do the old video chat through Instagram. We can do a video chat through uh like I'll be talking to my family on a regular basis using video chat uh, through Messenger. So uh, as far as communication, nothing really is going to be any different. For those people that I talk to on a regular basis, nothing's going to change. Unless where I talk to them from is going to change. And my time zone is different. But some very, very exciting stuff coming. And I mean it. I'm, a little, I'm, I'm more than a little disappointed in that. But I mean it. If I had never had the other one first... Happy with this, happy, happy, happy. But having had the other one, I think this is spicier than the than the other one. But the flavor of the other one was just so much more Thai. They missed it on this one. If anybody disagrees, I'd really love to see those people who, who disagree with me. Got one more trim. I gotta go in and get before I split. It was sort of a hint. How often do I trim my goatee? Sort of a hint right there. It's coming up, people. All right, uh, so listen, I'm gonna wrap it up right now. Really like to know if you've had Starkist. If you have, try the Bumblebee. Maybe you'll like it more, but I'm telling you, Starkist trounced Bumblebee. I know that Bumblebee ain't gonna be happy to see this one. I'm being honest. I know that Starkist is probably going. But Johnny Scoble, he's our boy. Anyway, we're gonna wrap it up right now. Uh, in the description box, you're not going to see a link for Bumblebee. It is what it is. You'll see a link for JohnnyScoble.com. Check it out. Everything right now in the store is signed. Get it while you can. Right there is the pepper. Click the pepper when you do. You're on the bus. I'm just the driver and so fortunate to be the driver. Um, about to go on a trip, people. It's going to be exciting. Uh, if this is your if spicy content, people, is your jam, this is your bus, uh, let's not miss any of these videos if you don't want to. Uh, click the bell for notification and Dropbox rolls down. Select all, but really to cover yourself, visit us daily because they drop the ball a lot. It is what it is. We love them anyway. Right there is Leo Fire. <sighs> love Leo Fire. Some wicked, exciting things coming, guys. More videos there. I love you guys. I'm Johnny Scoville. This was Chase the Heat.